In this video, we'll talk about taming your inner critic, approaches to silence inner negativity. You can be prevented from reaching your full potential or fueled for your success by your inner dialogue, and therefore you must learn to silence your inner negativities. You must also tame your inner critic to develop a more productive dialogue with yourself and proactively address your negative thoughts. Number one, become more conscious of your thoughts. You must understand that the fact that you think of something doesn't mean that it's true. Whatever you're thinking about, pay attention to it and try to be conscious of the messages you're sending to yourself, even if you become used to hearing your own narrations. More so, understand that most times, our thoughts are usually disproportionate, biased, and exaggerated. Number two, quit ruminating. You don't solve your problem when you ruminate on what you said that was questionable or what you did that was embarrassing. While you have a high chance of replaying the bad day you had or the mistake you made constantly in your head, you must understand that this act you're engaging in doesn't offer any solution. You can talk about a different subject, organize your desk, go for a walk, or distract yourself with an activity so that you won't focus on it. Number three, imagine your friend being in your shoes and think of what you'd advise him. You know if you have a friend that feels down after making an error or committing a mistake, you'll probably want to motivate him with encouraging words like, it's not the end of the world, and the likes. Now transfer all those compassionate words you would have given to your friend to you. Number four, examine the evidence. You'll be able to look at the situation less emotionally and more rationally when you look at shreds of evidence on both sides. There are times when your critical thoughts can be exaggeratedly negative, and the pieces of evidence you gather and examine will help you to get a clear reality view. Number five, use more accurate statements to replace overly critical thoughts. Respond with a more correct statement whenever you've got an exaggeratedly negative thought. For example, you can say, at times I do things really well, and sometimes I don't, in place of, I never do anything right. Number six, imagine your thoughts were true. How bad do you think it would be? This is a question you should ask yourself. How would you truly feel? The thing is, you can reduce the persistence barrage of worrisome thoughts and increase your confidence when you remind yourself that you're capable of handling problems or tough times. Number seven, balance acceptance with self-improvement. See, no one is perfect. Let no one pressure you over perfection. There are some days you'll do well, and there are some days you'll do the opposite. The only thing you can do is to stay conscious and work to become better. Accept your flaws and decide to do and become better. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.